is absolutely beautiful out today. The weather is perfect. It is just fantastic. It is sunny and there are these beautiful white clouds in the sky. Now, it is midday, so you know, I'm not gonna have any fancy sunrise, sunset colors. However, I am thinking about maybe trying to capture something in black and white with those gorgeous clouds. There's just something about uh, capturing the dark blue, the bright white, and then doing something really contrasty with it. So we'll see. I'm wearing one of my favorite t-shirts. It says, it's hard to see under there, but <laughs> it says happy camper. And that's exactly what I am because I'm finally getting an opportunity to get out. And I'm here at the Royal Botanical Gardens in the Arboretum and it's quiet and it's beautiful. All right, let's do this. is happening and I don't want to miss a thing Letting go is not a sin Oh, counting days I made it through This is the Nature Interpretive Center. Uh, I already started on a wrong turn. That last uh, path that I was on was incorrect. So I've had to come around this Nature Interpretive Center and start on the other path. The other place that I was in the springtime, there's incredible lilac bushes, which are amazing, but it's not springtime. So we want to go on this path here. Cause I will find the way on my own. Cause I'm out of control. I am all Off with the 70 to 300 on my lens there are a lot of little creatures under here if I remember correctly but I've also made sure to bring my tripod if you can see it back there because I'm going down by the water and so many times I also have my wide-angle lens so many times I've been out and I just say okay I'm gonna shoot with my long lens today and then I get there and I'm like oh a long exposure here with my wide angle would be so cool so We'll see. Also, I think a wide angle lens might really capture the clouds if I can find the right location. It's just amazing under here. Like it just smells so beautiful and it is absolutely like it's green, it's lush. It is the perfect day. Okay, it's beautiful here. There's a boardwalk and we've got marshlands and these absolutely gorgeous bulrushes and reeds. And what I would like to do is possibly set up my wide angle lens to get the boardwalk and some clouds and trees in the distance. Um, 
I'll have to just put it on and see because I just I can sort of picture it in my mind but I don't know what it's actually gonna look like and uh, and then I'm just gonna stand here and take some uh, long shots with the uh, 70 to 300 as well handheld but the boardwalk one is most likely going to be a uh, tripod shot. I don't know, it's not quite coming together. I'm walking around with my camera like this and I'm trying to find a good angle. And so far, it's not speaking to me. But there's all these really cool dragonflies flying around. I'm definitely gonna try and capture them. But now, I'm at a spot where there's like, there's a bench and gorgeous water. So, and lily pads. So I'm gonna see if maybe there's something here. Okay. So the lily pads are all kind of messy and the clouds are off to the right and um, it's not lining up. However, uh, I am just, I'm still just taking pictures and seeing what it looks like. And I wanted to show you the difference with a polarizer when you've got the sky. Now, it does depend on which angle you're at, but um, <laughs> the polarizer can really deepen the blues and change the, um, the water and how much reflection you've got on it. So I wanna show you what I've got here and uh, hopefully you'll be able to see it. So here's the polarizer and it spins, okay? Uh, just on the front there. It's pretty simple to put on. This is my Lee polarizer and um, yeah, let's take a look at what it looks like in the lens. So when I'm looking through, you can see that as I turn the polarizer, the sky and the clouds and the water change. They go brighter and then the sky gets like really deep and the clouds pop and the water is more see-through. So that's what a polarizer does. And um, I'm going to keep looking for a good angle. Or I think I might actually try to capture the, uh, the dragonflies and uh, there is, there's a few birds around. So back to my llamas. <laughs>
what a gorgeous day. So I have just been taking random photos and I have my ISO anywhere from 100 to 800 depending on the subject and uh, what the lighting is like. I love when I'm looking for flowers, I love when there's a flower that's lit by the sun, but the uh, around the flower is all kind of in shade or there's like a bit of a difference in that lighting so that it just really illuminates the petals and so on. So uh, anyway, the higher ISO I will use definitely whenever I've got uh, a moving subject and by moving subject I mean insects and dragonflies and butterflies. I almost captured this absolutely gorgeous butterfly. He just swooped out of the way <laughs> but uh, yeah anyway I know I haven't been around much I have been very busy and excited working on my uh, new -ish hobbies of gymnastics and uh, ninja it is if you've ever seen American Ninja Warrior then that is uh, the kind of thing that I work on there's an obstacle course gym near me and uh, I go with my son and we have a really fantastic time. So yeah, it's just been a lot of that, which is, um, it's so much fun. It's so, I love a challenge. I love to push myself in new directions. And so same with the photography, I need to do that a bit more. So that is my plan. I am going to just take more and more pictures because I've really missed it and I have missed you too. And uh, if you'd like to see, by the way, some of the activities that I have been doing, I, I made a TikTok channel and it's very, it, the little clips of, you know, gymnastics and ninja and so on that uh, they're not very edited. So don't expect much, but uh, I am over there, Rachel Lurch. And yeah, so YouTube channel, we are back on track, hoping and I don't know. I don't know what else. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so check back here for more new videos and I'm just going to explore. I love the outdoors. This has been a fantastic summer so far and uh, I hope to bring you along with me. If you haven't subscribed already, I would love it if you'd come along and uh, we can hike and take pictures together. Okay? Bye guys! We're running out of light The time is changing day to night Lines are fading out And we're dancing in the park Nothing's wrong with when I start